I think we're all really looking forward to it. I think we've had a good, uh, a good build up, good preparation. Um, the shore guys got the boat in really good nick, um, so uh, we should be able to just concentrate on uh, sailing the boat well. See ya. Thanks, Toby. See you, mate. See you, mate. Uh, we got 11.24 for the start, so we're going to get the boat going and getting our spot to the line, and basically setting up and uh, we're into it. been uh, up and down you know a few few changes and positions and, and it's pretty intense going into the night now it's a big moon up but uh, high cloud coming over probably winds will soften a bit it's starting to soften now you might see a bit of drizzle and rain uh, as the night progresses but still on the wind all the way uh, to the lizard from here really plug a bit of tide as we go around the lizard. Trying to get our way around the corner here. Um, breeze has just sort of just sort of died and the guys from behind have come in. I'm trying to get the back end of the boat which has a lot of drag in it out of the water. And um, praying for some wind. At the moment the only wind we're getting is from the apparent of the tide taking us directly that way. Fastnet Rock, now we've got a uh, full VMG run down to the Silly Isles, 160 miles or something like that. promising for the team, you know, it looked good for us and pretty happy to have that. Um, it's a shame we couldn't kind of convert that into a, a podium finish at least, but um, you know, a lot of positives to take out of it. It was intense racing. Uh, it feels a little bit like a week, week racing put in, uh, in, in 48 hours, a little bit more than 48 hours. Pretty intense and uh, good fun.